Okay, so um, hello everybody. I want to show you guys the game Close to 100. We played this in class, but your job today is to play this with someone at home. And the goal of this game, you're going to play with a partner, and the goal is in each round to get to um, the, the player who can get the number closest to 100. So it could be less than 100, it could be more than 100, but how many numbers away from 100 is what counts. And you want to, I mean, your goal is to get 100 if you can. Okay, so here's how we're going to play. It says game one and game two, but I think we're going to change this to player one and player two. And then you can um, go ahead and play as many rounds as you want. But if you can play up to three rounds today, that would be good. I want to show you where this is. This is, you just got this. On one side, it's a hundred chart. And on the other side, it's this. Okay, so the first thing that we need to do is we need to take our cards. These are our number cards, and we're not going to use the wild cards. We're going to use um, the other ones, and you're going to lay out six cards, okay? So, so that's a wild card. I'm going to put that away. So eight, three. Actually, I'm going to do these up here so that we can see. Eight, three. Two, two, you want six cards, okay? Zero and eight. So I'm going to choose four cards to make two uh, two digit numbers, and I'm going to add them, trying to get as close to 100 as I can. So if I add 30 plus 82. I think that is not going to get me very close to 100, okay? So I'm thinking about this right now. How can I get close to 100? I think that if I do 80, I wish I had another zero because I could do 80 and 20, but I can do 80 and 22. So let me see about that. So if I put that on my number line here, Okay, if I'm player number one, I'm going to put that on my number line here, and I'm going to do 80 plus 22. And to do plus 22 on the number line, I'm going to split that into 20 plus 2. So here we go, 80, 90, 100. So that's the plus 20, okay? That's 100, but then I have to do the plus 2. 101, 102, 102. Ah, that's pretty good. And so I am going to try that one. So on this one, I'm going to do 80 plus 22 equals 100. Oh, I'm sorry, equals 102. And then I have to figure out what is the difference between this number that I got and 100. So I'm going to try it this way. 102 minus 100 equals, and let's see if I did that. I have it right here. 102 minus 2 equals or minus 100 equals 2, right? The difference between 100 and 102 is 2. Okay, so my score is 2. Okay, now it is player 2's turn. I'm going to take these ones away because I already used those ones, but I'm going to leave these here, and then I'm going to add, I'm going to put in um, enough to make 6 cards. Okay, so 8, 3, 0, 3, 7, and nine. Okay. So I'm going to look at those cards and I'm going to see what could I add to two digit numbers to get close to 100. Ooh, I have an idea. I'm thinking that 70 and 30 equals 100. Okay. I could also do, ooh, I have another idea. I have another idea. If I did 97, and then I took these two, that would give me three. So I'm just going to show that right here on my number line. So I'm starting out at 97, okay, and I'm going up by three, 98, 99, 100. There's a plus three, and actually this number gets me exactly to 100. Yay! So those are the ones I'm going to choose. So 97 plus 3 equals 100. 
How many is it away from 100? Zero, so my score is zero. So now we're gonna compare, okay? Who won the round, player one or player two? So um, player, player one, the score was two, and player two, the score was zero. So who won? Player two. I'm gonna put a star by that one because player two won that round, okay? And then <coughs> you can just keep playing as many rounds <coughs> as you want to, but I do want you to show your work somehow, right? To show how you got to um, the numbers you got to, okay? So that's how we play close to 100.